in January we had only two days without snow and driving between city in Russia is considered more dangerous. So visa is not given for everyone and I have a friend who gets refusal of a visa. Hello guys, my name is Tanya, I'm Ruski and this is my channel and this is a new type of video where I am answer your question, any question about Russia. So if you can't find in the internet some information about Russia, just ask Tanya. How is driving in Russia? Safe? Not safe? I think more safe than in Malaysia. If we say seriously, let's see at two things. First of all, external conditions. There are four weather seasons in Russia with different conditions. Russian drivers need to get used to it, change tires. Russian drive at started snow tires in winter. In winter and autumn, we have a lot of precipitation, especially in St. Petersburg. How much snow we have now? In in January we had only two days without snow. Two days. Nobody can organize with that. It seems like all utility services go to Bali on vacation. <laughs> Administration of city can't organize, can't manage to removal all snow and that is why it is a reason of road accident as well and road accident it is not about snow it is also about ice road which we have as well a lot in our days the highways are being building in russia thank you but still there are many single lane roads without dividing in russia in russia intercity directions between cities that is why people often try to overtake and uh, that is no safe situation. And driving between city in Russia is considered more dangerous. The second thing of safe driving in Russia is the cultural of uh, driving. You know, the worst offenders are drivers of commercial public minibuses, which is called in Russia Marshrutka, because their salary depend on time and number of passengers they drive extremely insecure i take it every day and you know sometimes i think we take off it is hard for russian women to get visa for usa have you been in usa i have never been in usa and i dream about it as for english speaking country i was only in australia about visa i know it is not so easy after your application you should come for the interview uh, to the consulate your financial income is important and your goal of travel also so visa is not given for everyone and i have a friend who gets refused of a visa but I'm not sure that it is difficult only for women it is more about your active action if you really want to visit USA you do everything correctly and you get visa what do Russian women this about black men I think it is about attitude right despite of many comments under my video being black in Russia I strongly believe that there is no uh, racism to black people in Russia. There is bad attitude to another nationality, unfortunately. But it is not about black people. And there is a fact that a different appearance is always attractive. I know at least three couples where she is a Russian woman and he is a black man. And they live in Russia and two of them married and have a baby. Tell me, Tanya, how are electricity, water and heating gas charged for apartment dwellers? Do they match gas, water and electricity? How do they derive the amount of these items you use? Or do they have standard charge per square meters? There is a special device which uh, are installed in almost every apartment in Russia. This device uh, count uh, how much resources you spend during the month. In the end of the month, uh, you enter data, this information to the special site or may 
maybe you can go to special post and say manager data. Based of this information, they charged uh, how much money you should pay. My monthly payment for living in uh, not a big uh, apartment in the St. Petersburg is about 700 uh, rubles for electricity and my communal common utilities, including uh, water supply, cleaning the stairs, uh, hallway, garbage disposal and security. I pay for this around uh, 5000 of rubles. Is Zdrasti as informal as Privet? Zdrasti it is not informal. It is just short sound version of Zdrastvite. It turns out by itself when we sound quickly Zdrastvite. Zdrasti. Zdrasti. It is possible to say Zdrasti as a formal with unfamiliar people in some public place, but for our friend we don't say Zdrasti, we say Zdarova or Privet. I think all Russians say Zdrasti instead Zdrastvite because Zdrastvite is, it is so long. About writing, I recommend you don't use Zdrasti in writing because you may look illiterate. If your friend asks you something about Russia and you don't know what to answer, just say ask Tanya and send them this video. So see you next time. Я вас люблю.